All right, so we got some more leaks to talk about, and uh, this could be stuff that defines what banner you want to summon on. So uh, I think it's a little bit important. But um, if you don't know, recently, and I did make a video on it, I should have actually uh, pulled it up first, but uh, we got leaks that an Arthur, Excalibur Arthur is in, not inside Excalibur, but uh, an Arthur, a festival Arthur is coming. Which makes sense to me, uh, for second anniversary. Which makes sense to me, given that he is very close to, you know, appearing story now. Uh, and that's how most festivals have been releasing. Lo uh, not, I was gonna say, except Lost Fane and I think Zeldris. Um I mean, Zeldris, I guess, was very prevalent in the last chapter in story, but still. The one and Assault Melee showed up pretty much when the chapters came out. Uh, Goddess Liz showed up pretty much when the chapter came out. So did King. Uh, and so did Merlin. So, uh, Excalibur Arthur, if you've watched the series, or read the series, is about to come up. So I think it does make perfect sense for him to be a festival, especially considering they don't really... Like, for last anniversary, like, they, they didn't really choose, like, Meliodas for their festival. They probably are very loose with who they want to be a, uh, the anniversary festival, sort of. And, um, I think Arthur, personally, is more hyped than Goddess Liz. Excalibur Arthur, when I was reading the manga, I thought it was so cool. So that might be just me, but I think it makes sense. But we got some uh, info on his uh, his assets, you know, his effects and stuff like that. And this, he, like Regency even mentions, it could be from story. And I think it makes sense because again, like a character like this, you're gonna be able to play with him in story and stuff like that. Just like the one was playable in story, uh, Assault Melee wasn't playable in story because he was the enemy, but you got him in story and he had the, uh, the uh, you know, the cards and everything like that all bundled in the game beforehand because he appeared in story, uh, was it right, right after he released? So they were already, you know, preparing that for that to happen. And, uh, but Arthur, for example, he's a, he's a good guy, right? So you're gonna be able to play with him in story. Um, I hope they do let you play with the new Arthur and stuff like that. I'm assuming they will. But yeah, there's a new Arthur coming out, and um, they mentioned Arthur X, EX, so Arthur Excalibur, and um, that's pretty sick to me. I think that he is worthy of a festival, and I think he's way more worthy of a, like an anniversary festival than a lot of other characters that could have been it. Like, if anything, Global had the best anniversary festival, because it was the one, right? The one is the one. <laughs> like, the one was worthy of the anniversary for sure. But again, personally, I don't think Goddess Liz was worth, worthy of being the first anniversary, which was what happened on JP. JP got Goddess Liz as the first anniversary, which, like, regardless of what I think of her, I think she's the best thing in the game. Like, currently, for sure. She's the best thing in the game. Better than, than Golfer, currently. But hype-wise, like, you can you have to see my chat. We, we were watching the stream when they reviewed guys. Listen, my chat thought it was a prank. Like, <laughs> like, um, it was very disappointing. And I think Arthur is a way more fitting character than Elizabeth is. Um, I think the the first anniversary should have been the one. And Global hit it out of the park, making the one the first anniversary. It was so much better. Um, so good for them. Which raises the question, right? Because Global is, what, a month behind. I mean, Global did have the same patch as JP and two days earlier, but content-wise, uh, Global is missing, of course, the uh, Melaskal and Galen super boss, which I think should come in the near future. JP had it... Yeah. Three weeks ago. So I'm gonna assume that next week will be Melaskal and Galen super boss. And then uh, after that, the... Was it a month, the month after that, or two weeks after that? Should be, yeah, two weeks. I think I feel like should be the uh, the king, legend, super boss. Uh, so global is very close to JP, and I think they're gonna keep it like that because if you remember the dev notes that the Korean um, Korean uh, uh, forum had, said that the global version was gonna be a month behind, and that's exactly what we're seeing. Uh, so, Global in the next two weeks should also have the ReZero collab, and then after that, the uh, the Zaldris, which again, that's like a month after JP, makes complete sense. Um, but yeah, Arthur Excalibur, I was gonna raise the question, right, because Global is only a month behind, 
are they gonna market him a second anniversary and just go with that? Or are they gonna have the second anniversary be a separate banner, um, you know, almost a year from now? Because Global just had their anniversary, basically. The one came out, what, two months ago? I actually don't know <laughs> the exact date that he came out on Global, uh, compared to, comparatively to, like, right now. But it was, like, so close from, from now, right? Um, so I wonder if they're gonna market him on Global as a second anniversary or as a regular festival and then have their own second anniversary be a separate banner. I, let's see how it goes, but if Global can make like... Oh, I can't say. I mean, he already showed up on the anime like weeks ago, over, like what, months ago, right? But if Global can make like Mayo their second anniversary, oh, that would be sick. That would be absolutely insane, but... Regardless, uh, Excalibur Arthur should be coming, and this is probably, again, the assets to use him in story mode. And then we have Peronia. I actually had to Google what Peronia is. Uh, let me give a quick... Uh, <laughs> Peronia, because I'm sure a lot of you will not know who she is. It's this character. Right here. So... Yeah, she has her assets in the game. Again, mostly basically for story. And then JP is going to have a ne the next final boss being Darryarian Monspeed, which I'm really curious to see what the costumes will look like. Um, but again, um, you know, compared to you know, Galen and Melaskal, unfortunately, they will be just costumes for the characters that we already have. It's not going to be like for the next characters, which I was hoping that would be the case. I was hoping that they would uh, like release a new uh, Melaskal and Galen and have new costumes for them as well. Or that the, I hope that the costumes work with the new versions, but probably won't. But Dariari has like a phenomenal PV, PvP unit in blue Dariari and a phenomenal PvE unit in red Dariari, so she's good. She doesn't even like need a new version to have a, like a usable costume. But like Monspeed is kind of shafted. Um, there is still the possibility of getting a blue Monspeed, which could be good. I'm like crossing my fingers that he's gonna be good. Um, but you know. We still, we still also need a new version for Gun in the last color, we should get at some point. But uh, we're just gonna see how their transformation is gonna look like, and that's gonna be the costumes pretty much. But again, I'm very curious to see how the Darryarian must be gonna look like. This could be next week or two weeks from now. Um, probably next week, if I had to bet. Mm, I mean, we're still gonna be having the. Uh, the celebration stuff, so maybe not, but honestly, it could be next week uh, to have these, uh, the super boss. And again, Global should be getting Melaskal and Gallant, and two weeks from now, we should be getting King. So we got a good wave of super bosses. The only thing that Global missed was the reruns for all the super bosses that GP had, um, but that's just the effect of Global trying to catch up. JP and Korea. Like, we're trying to go so slow by releasing, like, one-unit banners and stuff like that. And having these reruns of super bosses that make new super bosses and so Global could catch up. And now the Global is catching up, the both games are, like, going, right? So, that's good. Uh, give me a second. Like, I just wanted to check what the uh, beta app thing was that Regents is mentioning. But it was, like, the, the previous leaks that we had. Um, but, yeah, that's, uh, that's some exciting stuff. So, this Excalibur offer should be playable in the story, which I'm very excited to do. Uh, I wonder how his animations are going to look in the infant like that. I hope he's good. I mean, we already have a good Arthur and green Arthur, but it's not like, you know, um, just like, well, we do have a good version of Meliodas in, like, Lost Fane Meliodas. Just because we have a new Meliodas, which is Assault Meliodas, doesn't mean that Lost Fane is completely unusable. Um, you know, there are situations, especially when you're facing type advantage, right, where Lost Fane would be better than Assault Mali. And stuff like that. So they could do the same thing for, for Arthur, where there are situations maybe you want to use green Arthur over the new festival Arthur. But let's see how this will go. Um, thank you, Regents, for the leaks. And uh, let me know what you guys think. Are you excited? Are you uh, skipping ReZero for this? Um, again, we had leaks for uh, a bunch of characters coming with Arthur. This Hauser, I'm hoping, will be a, a human buffer. We are missing, of course, Blue Hauser. And Green Heart. We only have one SR Hauser, right? Yeah, we have like two SR Hausers. Yeah, so we're missing like two SR Hausers, so he could, he could be either green or blue, actually. But regardless, this I'm hoping will be a human buffer for Arthur. If so, humans like are already insane, right? With the, with the Stranger Things collab, which again, lots of humans for Arthur. 
Um, but with the Stranger Things collab already here, with four new humans and two of them being like stupid good, like Eleven and Jump being like stupid good, I'm kind of expecting actually Human Buffer to come out so that they can market that as like a needed unit, you know what I mean? But yeah, thank you guys for watching and uh, let me know what you think.